Hi, my name's Richard Reynolds. I'm the Senior Agronomy Advisor for Anglian Water and uh, coming to talk to you today about why we as Anglian Water want to work with farmers. So one of the key things that we want to do is talk to farmers to invest in farmers. Um, it's really important for us to set up tools and to have an environment where farmers can learn new things and, and get new skills added to what they're doing. Because a lot of our water, well, all of the water ultimately lands on agricultural land before coming into our water treatment works. It's really important that we have a connection to the agricultural environment. Uh, but it's not just a once off every year, every second year. I think it's important that we've got that connection for the long term, which is why we feel courses like this are really important to build longer term resilience to help develop business plans that look not only to the challenges in the next year or so, but the next three to five years. And given the challenges the agricultural sector is facing at the moment, I think it's even more important, whether it's the climate changes that we're looking at, whether it's the changes in economics, whether it's global supply, whether it's the uh, subsidies and funding that's coming through, whether it's the new opportunities that we're seeing whether it be carbon markets and nature and environmental services, all of those are, are huge amounts of uncertainty that, that we're looking to work in and supply both food and water to our respective customers. So any course that adds value, adds resilience to the agricultural sector is really important to what we're doing. The course here is run by the folks at Land Management 2.0 who have uh, a great track record in, in doing really engaging and interesting online training courses. Some of you will have seen them during the first lockdown, which is why we've, we've engaged them in this group here. Um, the course itself is broken into modules. There's an introduction um, followed by a couple of more practical courses around baselining, around practical opportunities, information and sources of funding. I think all of those are key and important to, to consider in those business plans for the next three to five years and should be important things to, to provide that resilience. The way the course is structured is the modules will go live on a Tuesday, followed by a 45 minute mentoring session on the Thursday, where there's a great opportunity to ask questions, to probe, to question a little bit more. And we'd really encourage as much conversation as possible. The hope is that we will be flagging new opportunities, being thought provoking. We're not necessarily going to present the solutions to everything. I think the challenges that we are facing are far more complicated than, than any one course could necessarily hope to achieve. The hope here is to connect yourself with peers and with sources of funding and sources of insight to help you start making those business decisions, help asking those questions. And I would very much encourage anybody that wants to take things further here to get hold of the likes of myself, get hold of Land Management 2.0 so we can see what we can do to support. <laughs>